Hi everybody, this is Spring with Soaps and Suds and Such and today I am going to be showing you how I make uh, my Nastrium tea. Uh, now this tea, it can be, you know, Nastrium is a beautiful flower. It can be used to uh, top a salad, use the green part of it in a salad. But it also has medicinal properties that people just don't realize. And uh, for the tea, if you haven't seen Nastrium, this is what the flowers look like, this is what the leaves look like. I'm going to be using for the tea the leaves, fresh leaves. And, um, you know, it can help with, um, a lot of people will use it for um, kidney, like kidney problems. Um, it's one that you you may want to do a little research on because you know not everybody should use it um i like to use it and you know I, like i tell everyone with, with any of the teas any of the herbs any of the medicinal plants research uh, or ask your physician you know if uh, before you go trying just anything but uh, i like to take the leaves and I'm going to be using probably about around two teaspoons is all I'm going to use because all I'm making is one cup. And I'm going to uh, make this really tiny. See what I've got in there so far. And uh, I'm using the smaller leaves because they are more peppery. And I like a peppery taste to my tea. And... Um, Nastrium is really a wonderful medicinal plant. Um, you got cuts or scrapes. You can make a compress using Nastrium. And um, makes really wonderful, you know, just to help that, help with cuts and uh, abrasions or such. You can make a tincture with it. Okay, I want to get about two teaspoons in there. And I am just guessing. I don't, I'm bad to not measure, but I um, have to measure a lot when I make my soap and stuff like that. But as far as just doing something for myself, that looks like about two teaspoons. Okay, um, and to this, then you are going to add boiling water. Just a cup of boiling water. I've got my pretty teacup here that I'm going to use. And um, put that all the way up to the top. Nastrium is actually full of uh, vitamin C, so it helps combat a cold. Um, can work. I'm going to cap that with this plate. Um, it can help. It kind of has like properties like an antibiotic. So, you know, if you feel like you're going to get in sick or something you can try to use the nastrium tea um, during the summer when you have it grow and just eat you some leaves or something um, if you feel like you're going to get sick but uh, this is how I make my nastrium tea and um, I don't use the blooms in the tea now for a higher tonic sure um, salad yes but uh, I'm going to let this steep for about 10 minutes then I'm going to strain it strain out my green part the leaves and um, I'm going to actually sweeten this with honey I'm not going to be using stevia I don't I prefer not to add any mint or anything to this one um, that's your own preference but as I said do research I hope you find this helpful